ladies and gentlemen, aliens and fucking, I don't even know what the hell to call half you people anymore. <laughs> Today, we're gonna be... <laughs> Yo, I'm so fucking stupid, bro. I just, <laughs> I should delete that. <laughs> <laughs> or I might leave it. Uh, today we're going to be reacting to when Godzilla and Kong showed everyone why they run the MonsterVerse. So, without further ado, because this is like 16 minutes long, we're not going to talk much. Let's just get straight into this shit, because... There we go. So it starts, and Kong over here playing tug of war with this Pokemon for some good eats. <laughs> but then, bro, heard this Pokemon. roar and was like, do my, my eyes, eyes deceive me? me? Uh, <laughs> so stupid, bro. Uh, <laughs> Man took this as a challenge. Boy said, I know fools ain't pushing pain on my turf. This Skull Island. Y'all must ain't see my movie. I put this hood on the map. Cone pulled up to scope the scene. But this whole time, it was just this little frog creature over here. That shit had me tight. I ain't gonna Cone lie. pulled I, up I to this Minecraft to ravine with this diamond pickaxe. Think he finna go farm some minerals. So bro stupid, looked down bro. and knew he was about to get some enchanted diamond armor. <laughs> he landed and saw the ape-shaped skulls. Man's look flabbergasted. Like his name gonna be next in somebody's bio. <laughs> It must have been some of his dead homies from way back. Kong walked through this waterfall and entered a whole new biome. But this place already on timing. You got this Kevin Durant shadow build walking up on bro. Man's Kong squared up immediately. Can't never catch bro lacking no more after them beatdowns got put like on him in nah, the last movie. For real, that but was looks bad. are deceiving because it was just little Diddy Kong. Kong tried to dap bro up out of respect, but Diddy was like, oh, heck no. Nah and bit that boy oh, Kong on the oh, finger oh, like he was I taking a dirty. chump out of a glizzy. Oh, then he oh, gonna pause. run away. Man, it's just pulled the weakest hit and run I've ever seen in my life <laughs> <What> because <laughs> all it took was five strides and Kong was about to two-step on the back of little man's head. <laughs> Kong got high alert on though because soon as he entered that other section, somebody dropped behind him. Ugh. Or should I say Damn. something? Because I know I this not no ape. Bro, it looked like somebody took Caesar from Planet of the Apes DNA and tried to cook up a Kong clone in the <laughs> test tube. But OG Kong over here like, oh, they done took my guy to great clips. They skipped all the formalities though. And two Damn. ox spirit Kong mushing his head into the ground. But Kong down here like, wait, hold up. My name is in the movie title. It's up for y'all. He slammed his rock against bro's head, the main turning his brain into pudding. And somebody called Dana White. We got your next star. Because we got apes pulling off rear naked chokes now. But his man's over here team killing and caved his head in. Just damn. to catch an overhead to his spine. God damn. Ooh, boy. I know bro gonna be feeling that tomorrow. Catching a two-ton hammer fist to your back will put anybody down. A Smooth brain wanted to get his get back though. And tried to sneak Kong. But dude caught this Flintstone bone. And looked at bro like, bone? it's not your body my G. Booming him into his little homie. Now Damn, thing nah, one Kong tried to end Kong's career with that enchanted battle axe, but caught a leg bone to the bottom God. of his chin. Bro finna have to eat liquid banana after that lit. While trying to receive his strap, Diddy Kong pulled up on little rascal time and tried to reorganize Kong's this face. This was the funniest little man shit right thought here. It was sweet and got turned into a melee weapon. One, two, finish it. Three goofy niggas Yo. down. Bro Kong really squat wiping these doodle bobs. Man yeah. is a solo Q menace. And these must be some short bus apes, cause they not learning they lesson. Bro caught a hook to his noggin, Dang, and he's out he for laid the count. him out. Schlumped. That was he it. Up talking to Kobe, trying to figure out how to be the same animal and a different beast. <laughs> R.I.P. Black Mamba. But why Kong going devious timing? Bro really down yeah, smashed Bro's to... back end. Even nah, if he, he lives this phase, he will have ass. scoliosis for life now. But Kong still not done. Like what? What's wrong, these fools monkey? must got him in that <laughs> mode. He lifts bro's head up to scramble his teeth around and it Damn. took a sneak attack from his homie to stop Kong from turning his head into <laughs> mashed potatoes. Kong really a real nigga just trying to find some real homies is all. But bro right here, he really deserved his fate. Cause how you gonna get saved and instantly get back to home? Nah, Kong for real. that attack and told this bro shit. this is Skull Island nigga. And Sparta kicked him off the ledge. The Caesar clone knew it was up. And the tried to Caesar skedaddle clone. out the spot. Cone picked up this rock, decided to show off his QB skills. Man's yeah. really all pro in this throwing junk. He tossed a <laughs> Hail Mary way in the sky. Dome and bro in the back of his Damn. neck just because he felt like it. This goofy cone really petty for real. He know dang well that was unnecessary. Then he had to keep up the bad cop act. Pulling out little Diddy Kong over here bush camping like he in Fortnite. <laughs> booming him on his shoulder trying to get him to drop ah. the location of the ops. Lil bro was like, alright, dang bro. It ain't even that serious. Mm -mm. Oh, fuck is this shit? 
the shit out so of here. So Kong and his sidekick pulled up to the spot. Kong looking like <laughs> Phantom when he finds out all he got left to eat is some salad. He like, MLK didn't <laughs> die for this. Slavery in my hood? Oh, heck nah. So he Damn. walks down there, and this is where I knew it. Whoever is in control of this operation ain't with the games. Because tell me why it pans past three ape kebabs just sitting in the middle of the yard. <laughs> Like, what y'all doing? Y'all just don't see this? This is clearly an act of Black Yo, Air Force stupid, energy. Bro. We're dealing with a real psychopath, ain't it? Cone sees one of the yard commanders harassing Damn. someone and slid in for a talk. Yepatron came in spitting all kinds of hot fire in bro's face. Yo, so Cone slapped some CT across his jaw so he Damn. won't forget to brush his teeth next time. And then started banging on his chest, letting them know he not here for all talk and no action. After that display of outright aggression, the Titan Reaper himself is revealed. Skull Damn. King. Man's posing on the throne with all this spiritual <laughs> pressure. And from this beast Titan build, I knew Kong was finna take his first L of the movie. And bro's eyes are crystal blue. Nigga got that Gojo effect. Man, I'm not even sure me, if Kong on, the main character. You know what, man? I, I want to say something about this because... Scar King was really a letdown. I don't know if it was just me, but like they, they built this dude to be like... He was going to give Kong and Godzilla a run for his money. This dude was a straight pussy. Like, he couldn't do shit without Shimu. Like, he really couldn't do a goddamn thing. And at the end, wh whenever he lost it, he that was it. He was finished. He had nothing for them. His ass got whooped. I mean, spanked. anymore. Dude walks out punking all yeah. the apes. And he is literally on anime character Yo, timing. Just... I wouldn't be surprised if he had a flash step and popped the Do domain expansion. Got Kong looking up like, oh dang, he looking kind of comfy. Scar came down, sizing Kong up, even sticking his grimy hands all over Kong's oh, BBS no. grill. And this is where we you? see bro's griminess on display. While everyone laughing, bro got tight with Lil Diddy Kong for bringing bro here. But his big homie was like, chill, Scar. It ain't that serious. Scar like, yeah, you right. Looking Kong dead in the face before he drop kicks bro dead no, into the pool of time to be Jesus. Oh yeah, it's up. Kong is heated and Scar ain't no hope. Clear it, clear it. They finna bang out. Both these menaces strap up and the scrubs start dropping the fight music. Scar swings that bone whip at Kong and man's really weave nation with that dodge. He started feeling himself trying to grab the whip like this mug not laced with jagged edges. Got his hand looking like the roof of my Damn. mouth when I eat Captain Crunch. <laughs> right here is where Kong has his first nigga moment. He rushed in, got weaved twice with ease. Scar moving like he been training for this all his life. Then he parries the battle axe, weaving out to give Kong a little love tap on Not his shoulder. Lie, he was Kong thought he could Kong be Weave Nation and Sneaker Nation certified, but called him upper but this is why, instead. You know Scar why I call him a pussy? Bro, then put him because into of, one of those Auntie Anne's like, pretzel Kong, knots choking him. Oh, Kong on. saw Lil Diddy looking exactly at him why. and was like, I ain't finna be grits today. Hitting that Uno reverse, then slam Scar on his bro. spleen. But oh, bro he was did. starving. You see that? So he ate that jump and called. All he did was just threw him off of him and my man went straight into panic mode and summoned shimu like bro it reminds me of like how can i say whenever i don't know if any of y'all ever played a fighting game when dude beat you like first round right they're the most confident motherfuckers but then as you start winning the next two all of a sudden they're scared and they, they start trying to come up with any excuse or try to find ways like bro like it's just straight bitch mode that's why I, I think Scar King was a straight bitch in this movie. Like, my man just got reversed. He just got reversed. That's it. He just threw him off of him. And my boy immediately panicked and said, you know what? Let me summon my fucking ultra rare Pokemon. Called Fuck off his jumper here. nigga unit. And Kong, I'm going to be real. It might be chalk for you, bro. Dude just ate a Batista bomb and then posed like a JoJo's character. It turns out. Bro, not just enslaving apes, but even legendary Pokemon. Man, I even got ass Shimo, catching. I don't know. Now man, we get introduced to this menace the way he Shimo. Is, Scar uses that crystal it. to make Shimo attack Kong with that spearmint breath. He barely escapes that first blast, grabbing his axe, blocking the second one. But this junk got an AOE effect, turning his hand into a popsicle. Right before Kong finna get sent to the gulag, Diddy Kong <laughs> showed him the escape route so he doesn't get turned into Italian ice. Got Scar over Damn. here with his strap. That's like the equivalent of getting your chain snatched by a random nigga. This Damn, jump, he cold. not fair though. Bro's build is too OP. 
Mans is a demigod build with a one-shot monster pet. <laughs> so Kong pulled up to Egypt. Bro came out the portal gripping the pyramids with this infinity gauntlet. Mans gets break. one upgrade and thinks he's Thanos. But Godzilla wasn't with the games. Oh, nah, Niggas Godzilla pulling up on, on his turf ain't gonna cut it. Dude stood up like he finna put LLK. Hi, we're visible. Oh, the wireless company ass, that man. makes things visible. Killing me. With us, what you see is... Long Lil Kong in someone's bio. And tell me why bro has a play stretch build. They got mans looking too athletic. Kong threw up his set, cause he ain't no hoe. Godzilla said, I right, bet. You think I'm playing? I'm, I'm pulling, pulling up, up on you, nigga. And why dove into the ocean like Mike yeah. Phelps. Bro, Godzilla really a crash out to be honest. Dude got dissed one time and now he thinks it's cool to casually tarnish thousands of civilians in his domestic violence against Kong. Man seeing red and starts saying freak everybody. Godzilla jumped out that water and started pressing Kong. But Kong realized mid press that he really came to just get help for bro to beat Scar and Shimo. He like, hey bro, chill, chill. We got a common op game. Godzilla was Godzilla like, was like I ain't hearing all that. And tackled bro like he was Aaron Donald. Nigga eradicated thousands of years worth of world history with the pyramid. <laughs> These kaiju have no respect, bro. I tell you. Yo. Got Kong over here posted up, rethinking his current situation. <laughs> but bro locked in, though, and threw some grime in Godzilla's <laughs> eyes. Mans ran noggin first into another pyramid. He like, oh, man. <laughs> that was weak. And started throwing a tantrum. And what happens next? literally makes this movie s tier in the fight category bro press kong against the wall and has to remind everyone that his name hold weight <laughs> he picks up kong and Yo, i'm talking what the feet hell? off the ground type jump then he hit bro with that kaiju oh! suplex kong gonna... got a dose Damn. of instant cte after that boom like what are they feeding these niggas bro i would have <laughs> never thought there would be a day i see my twin kong get boomed on his spinacus <laughs> but kong is a get back guru i tell you that Bro nah, loaded Kong, up that Kong infinity gun, in. sending a nuke into Godzilla Jones, Damn. who really got one shot. Is this really y'all go? Cause my nigga <laughs> Kong doing him the worst way. I can't Swing. lie. I never let another nigga have me on my back, but that's just me. But Kong not done <laughs> with bro, it. and puts him in a combo extender, then spams him with heavy attacks, <laughs> laced with concussion stones from that infinity gun, putting that boy to sleep. Damn. Man's really got humble for real. Need to change his name to Godzilla with a lowercase g. Cause he ain't Yo, no god for real. Doing my boy dirty. Over here dragging bro to another phase like he just handled some lightweight. But he heard that infamous charge up and knew it was finna be crash out city in this mud. Kong looked back like Godzilla really weak for real. Got to pull out the blast breath every time he finna lose a fight. Mans ain't trying to throw no hands for real. He don't no struggle. He got like three Zenkai boosts in this movie Not alone real. in his five minute cameo. That blast breath made a smoke screen, clearing the way for nah. this spear to the gut. Then he curb stomps Kong into the earth, charging Damn. up another easy way for Kong to see his dead homies. <laughs> right here, I thought it was up for Kong. Man's really finna get crisped up into God some pork damn. rounds from this radioactive lizard. Fuck? Well, at least until this moth kaiju showed up to recruit them for the anti-scar campaign. Look at <laughs> the it. Anti -scar Two campaign. ops made friends about to stand on business. So we switched to a new fade scenery, and Scar came in destroying junk like he owned the place. I'm talking one, two, three, four, multiple goofies deep, and think he's finna run some pockets. <laughs> but all we hear in the background is, yeah, it's it from, bro. And what do we know? Two real niggas have arrived. My boy Kong and Frazilla came out the smoke, falling <laughs> booty towards Scar and Shimo. I know these fools would have gave you same boat a run for his money. I can't lie though, this scene of two monkeys riding in on these legendary Pokemon, <laughs> chef's kiss. Whoever cooked this up, yeah, Yo. they need a raise. Nah, for real, right they do. before Kong was finna put Scar on layaway, the gravity <laughs> reset, inverting all their settings. Now they fighting in the air, and Kong is about to get dead dirty. Cause Scar is in the assassin class with the <laughs> movement. Man's flipping from rock to rock, and initiating a fade with circle spams. Bro, wrap Kong up and put five toe jams into his <coughs> mouth. And look Damn. at Frozilla over here not holding his weight, getting hit with that spearmint beam. Got the moth shawty saving this man. But he came out the ice on timing, literally swimming through the air to crash out on Shimo. <laughs> the gravity starts the to get a little update, on timing. and all the kaiju begin to fall back into the earth realm portal. <laughs> Gamefly is Bro, the best way to try ass, new games. man. God damn. Rent it. Love it. Fuck. Buy it.
Scar and Shimo came out that portal like they had Black Air Forces on. Bruh. While Shimo over here making the next Ice Age move with IRL. Scar over here celebrating like he already it's had stupid. the dub. He like, yeah, this my hood now. But Cone popped that fade stone in his gauntlet. And rock bro straight to sleep. Yo, bro got damn, up and spit he, a building size tooth the out his shit mouth. Out got cone like, dang, I really rocked that nigga. Even Fryzilla hit a point blank Fry blast Zilla. right that Shimo gut. <laughs> now this fade then turned into a bang out session. These kaiju really going lick for lick in this fade. And now I guess Kong done realized it. Bro looked inside this building and saw the humans in turmoil <laughs> and was like, dang, we really be trampling on these fools when we be throwing Not hands down. Real. And it's about time, bro. I thought these casual homicides, these kaiju was committing on humankind would go unnoticed. Yeah. <laughs> Shimo came in charging at Kong, but Godzilla nah. spear broke. I think Godzilla was really. Like the elite socks and <laughs> he was really on timing at the end. Godzilla wasn't fucking it pans around. back to Hollow Earth where Lil Diddy Kong done found Kong's battle axe. Right here, I knew the bang out session was coming to an end because if this axe gets used, somebody's getting greased. Scar grabs a building and throws it at Kong, but after blocking it, he gets flip kicked into a combo where Shimo is mushing his face into the city, Damn. giving him that Broly treatment. But while this grimy behavior is taking place, Godzilla renews his Sneaky Nation badge and charges up a final flash. Man's think he's Vegeta. Scar looks back in huh? disbelief. Bro is baffled at this sight. But before he gets sent back nah, to the lobby, he got pulls cooked. this exquisite weave out his bag. He slung that whip at Godzilla, and Bro catches it, looking at him like, I might not be I'm a gorilla. I'm telling you, he was on timing. Gorilla grip. Oh, pause. Then pause. he booms Bro on his back <laughs> and breaks his strap. Man's finna get exposed without it. his melee weapon. Mm -hmm. Meanwhile, Kong over here fighting the Sub-Zero variant. Couldn't and do he's shit losing. after that. But Godzilla comes in with a third party, biting Bro's neck. This gave Kong just enough time to recoup, but before he could get right, Scar pressed him. Then here comes a familiar scene. My guy is getting put in yet another rear naked choke. Like, bro, I know you done at least came up with a counter for that by now. It pans back, and Diddy Kong dragging his behind into frame with Kong's axe. Kong gave him that look like, do it for the gang, little bro. Kong bit dudes on. Damn. Probably gonna have to talk to that boy Magic Johnson after that blood hit his system. Uh. But Diddy Kong hit that little move and broke the crystal, sending everybody flying back. And that was Scar it. gets up and grabbed Diddy Kong by his neck just to catch a haymaker to his jaw. And here's God another example damn. of peak cinema. Kong grabbed bro and was like, I'm sorry for what we're about to do to you. Nah, and throws him dirty. at Godzilla, who then tail whips him back at Kong, playing ping pong with Bro's <laughs> body. Kong holds him up for the finishing blow, and Shimo comes to his senses like, shoot, let me get in on this. And his bro with that spearmint beam cannon. Got dude's body on thin ice while Kong is gripping him by the neck. Then Kong had to go ahead and put him down. Jumping off this building from max height to obliterate Scar across the rubble. These kaiju getting out of hand, bro. They getting athletic and they acquiring weapons of mass destruction. <laughs> like who they fighting next? Because these goofies looking mighty OP. Hey, y'all know what to do. Smash that like button, comment, and Yo, subscribe. Hold up, hold up. And go ahead and buy them heads. Where, where is Scar, what you're about where, where to Scar do King? To you and throws him at. Bro, Scar King was a straight man. Hold on. Let me, let me, let me, I gotta find something where it's actually showing Scar King. No, that was actually perfect right there. Hold on. Even apes, but even legendary Pokemon. Look, look, look. Man, stick, he's when I first saw this image in the trailer, you know how excited I was for this dude? I was like, man, we about to get something, you know what I'm saying? That's gonna give Godzilla and Kong a run for their money. Man, Scar King couldn't do a goddamn thing. If he didn't have Shimu in the beginning, he wouldn't have done shit. Honestly, the movie probably would have ended in that first fight my man got flipped over one time and was like nah you know what let me call my ultra rare pokemon because i can't do shit nah i i think he i think he was decent decent but he really had nothing he didn't have anything godzilla took that whip from him and that was it that was literally it he couldn't do shit my man got packed up fast <laughs> <laughs> Yo, I can't, man. This shit had me dying. Oh my god. Um, I really gotta look into more videos like this. This is this is funny. I really like videos like this because, man, homie's commentary is, man, he funny. Nah, for real, he funny. 
But yeah, man, I I don't know. You got to give me your honest opinion about this movie. Like I liked the movie. I really enjoyed this movie. But Scar King as a villain, I expected so much more. I really did. I thought this dude was going to be like in the hierarchy, you know. He was going to be something fucking crazy in reality. I don't even know how he captured Shimu because how the hell did he... I, I'm pretty sure they explained it in the movie, but I just don't see how he got the fucking crystal, how he got Shimu. I don't see it. Like, the dude didn't do anything that was like, oh my god, this is why he's so powerful and... No. To me, he was a bitch. From the moment I saw him get flipped over and he immediately called Shimo, I was like, get this guy out of here, man. He ain't, he ain't no he ain't no real G. He a fucking bitch. <laughs> Anyways, let me know what you guys think. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you like this video, please let me know so I do more. Um, appreciate the um, support as always. Thumbs up, subscribe, share, all that good stuff. And I'll catch y'all in the next one. All right?